Hello everyone and welcome to the Shrimpy channel. In this video, we're going to talk about how we would deposit funds into your account before we can start trading any cryptocurrency. As you can see, I've logged into my Binance account. If you'd like to follow along, you can go ahead and log into your Binance account as well. The way that cryptocurrency exchanges typically work is they have different wallets that you can use to deposit funds. In this case, Binance has a number of different wallets. The wallet that we're going to be using for this tutorial is the Spot Wallet. So let's go ahead and click the Spot Wallet. You can see here all of the different assets that are available on the exchange for trading, as well as all of the ones that you can deposit into your trading account. At the top here, we have the fiat balances. So if you wanted to deposit fiat currencies, this is where you'd go ahead and do that by clicking deposit. And we also have cryptocurrencies. So if you already have cryptocurrency from another source and you would like to transfer it to the exchange so that you could trade on the markets, you could do that right here. So for example, say we already have some chain link we can go to Chainlink, we could select Deposit, and we could scan this QR code that they've sent us, or we could use this address right here to deposit the funds into our account. And then those funds will show up in our Spot Wallet, right on this page right here. Please notice that uh, every account has different deposit addresses, so your account will not have the same deposit addresses as my account, so you should not scan this QR code and you should not enter this address that you see on my screen right here, you should go to your account, make sure that you're copying the one that's relevant for your account. If you had sent it to this QR code, that money would show up in my account instead of your account. Going back to the spot wallets, you can see here that I have a variety of different assets. So right now I've hidden my balances so you can't see how much in each asset I have, but you can see that I hold all of these different assets. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to our team. We're always happy to help. Otherwise, we hope to see you on the Shrimpy application, and we look forward to seeing you in the next video.